Can we get started? I just wanna turn you out. We should leave this party. Go someplace where them clothes come off and I can see that body. Okay, so this vlog is gonna go backwards, but I totally forgot to mention this brand that I am in love with and they are called Dossier. By the way, my husband is like playing games, so if you hear him, ignore that. But this is the brand Dossier. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Excuse me if I'm saying it wrong, but yes, this is it. They are a perfume brand that I am in love with. So all of the fragrance that they have are inspired by designer Colt Scents which is awesome. Here is a perfume box. Oh my God, why is it so blurry? Okay, wait, there you go. Okay, so we got sent two perfumes that I got to pick out and I love both of them. But anyways, we're gonna talk about this one. As you can see here, they send the bigger bottle and then they send a sample. So what you should do when receiving your perfume is Always try the sample first in case like you don't like it or anything before opening the bigger one. For example, if you don't like the smell or anything, all you have to do is return it within 30 days from receiving your box and they will charge you absolutely nada at all. And make sure to have the bottle unsealed because you definitely gonna get your money back if you opened it. So the first fragrance I got is Fresh Floral 3, then the next one I got is Fresh Floral 1. And then if you go on their website, they'll tell you like what perfume smells the closest to the one you picked or the one you're going to pick. I don't know why, but this little like boxing is really cute. And the box says, the fair alternative to luxury perfumes. So if you're trying to spend like crazy amount of money on perfume, I suggest you go to Dossier. Dossier. I think that's what it's called. I'm not sure. Anyways, okay, I'm gonna do Fresh Floral One. And I'm gonna ask Hubby if it smells good. Oh my god. I don't know why I'm gonna spray this right now. It's already about to be bedtime, but it's alright. Mmm, it smells good. I think I know what this one smells like. This is the Dolce & Cabana light blue. Yep, this is the one I picked out. Oh, I love this smell. Oh my God, and it smells exactly the same. I'll leave a link in the description box so y'all can check them out. I'll go see what my husband thinks. Does this smell good? Now, we are gonna get back to the regular vlog, so rewind and start over again. Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to the vlog. Let me turn off my music. I've been listening to the weekend album all morning. Not sure what we're gonna do today. Um, Are you vlogging? Yes. And look at this. Um, Dusty. This has been rough. Yes. Well, I'm telling you, man. Yeah. I just want to go to work. But we can't. It's hard for us to stay home because we're so used to going. And doing stuff. Especially out. going to the office. Yeah. Not going out, but like Working. going to work and all that stuff. So, Jelly's on maternity leave now. <laughs> Yeah, look at his haircut, guys. Hey, like, I'm not gonna cut my hair until this quarantine is done. I heard we've been in quarantine for five months. Five months? You think I'm about so? I have long ass hair and I can't even wait. So, right now, I am about to start cleaning my bathroom because it is extra dusty. Like the countertops, especially if you don't clean it like within a week or even a couple days, it gets so dusty. You guys can see the dust. Yeah. I need to clean and I need to dust it all, make sure it's all cleaned up, so I'm going to do that right now. I'm 
countertops. Okay, anyways, so I just got done cleaning the countertops and I'm not supposed to be itching my face, but it's super itchy. Anyways, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I posted like all my stories of like my bathroom sink, well, my bathroom drawers being like really organized and how I organize it. And I know a lot of you guys wanted to see it on my vlog, so I figured why not? I'm just gonna show you guys how my drawers look like under my sink. It's not that organized. I'm still gonna show you guys because I even like watching videos like this. This is my side of the sink and then that's hubby's side of the sink. It's super clean now. I'm super happy about that. But then like the mirrors, I still need to use Windex and clean that, but I'm gonna have Orsino do that. Anyways, this is my area. So the first drawer we have here is like all my hair accessories. I got my headbands in here, scrunchies in here, and then this little basket I have my bobby pins and my little rubber bands when I braid my hair. And then I have my, what do you call it? I forgot what these are called. Hair ties here. And then I have like clips and hair clips in this other little basket then i have my comb brushes and all that in this section i love it when it's super organized because i don't know why i just like seeing it super clean it just makes me feel better now we're on to the next drawer and this is like my little makeup area as you guys can see i do not use a lot of makeup but these are like some of the makeup brushes and makeup things i use and then in this bag is my everyday makeup i use i honestly probably use about four products in here my mascara i use two mascaras and then sometimes my foundation if i need it if i'm going to work or something and i want to put on a little makeup i'll just put this in my bag but other than that i just leave it here and then like i said these are like my extras i use if I need it, if I'm trying to look a little bit cuter and all that. And then in this area, I put my gel and then my mousse. Kind of like my usuals I use for my hair. And then I have my mist from Dermalogica here that I use. And this drawer is my body care products. So I have a lot of things. I have lotions from... Sol Janeiro, this is literally my favorite lotion brand. If you guys follow me on Instagram, I post them literally all the time. Especially this one, this is a Brazilian Bum Bum. My favorite go-to, especially during the summer. I love using that. And I have a whole bunch of different like SPF sunscreen. I have loads of glow oil, especially from Sol Janeiro because they have the best to be honest, and I cannot wait until summer. So I can start using these again. The Sunset Glow Oil, I cannot say the name of that, but you guys can see it. This is my favorite glow oil so far. I just have like belly oil for my pregnant belly. And then I have like body soap, body oil, and then my each and every um, deodorant. Okay, so we are on to the next now. And this area we have is literally under my sink. I feel like it's kind of dirty. Sorry, but I'm still going to show you guys how I organize everything. So in this basket, I have like all my bath and body work stuff. I got all my hand soaps in here. Usually get all these hand soaps when they're on sale because I'm not trying to pay full price for any of those. And then same with my um, body and shower gel. I have in this basket and same exact thing i get these when they're on sale and let me tell you guys my favorite is the at the beach shower gel oh my god it smells so good and then in this basket so this basket i got from ikea we got our q-tips in here our extra ones i got pads which i probably do not need to use right now but in this area, I usually put like all my hair care products in here, like my shampoos, conditioner, and all of the stuff I need. So those are like all hair care products and then my random girl things. And then we got our extra Q-tips here. Then in this little area we have, oh my goodness, Orsino does not know how to put things away. 
In this little basket, I have our nail stuff. I have nail polishes, nail polish remover, and then all of the things we need to clean our nails. Usually I take this out when I do Orsino's nails because he loves when I give him a manicure and a pedicure, so yeah. And then in these areas, nothing too crazy, but I'm still going to show you guys what I have. In this drawer, we have like our lighter for our candle, since it's literally right there. Scissors, pens, you know, like the random stuff we need to use. Hand sanitizers, towels, and yada yada. And then we have more Q-tips here. And then we got our lint roller in case we need it, but we haven't opened that thing yet. And then in this drawer, it's not organized, I'm sorry, but we have my hair blow dryer, flat iron, and all of my curling irons in here. We're just gonna close that because it's really dirty. In this drawer, which is the last drawer, I was thinking about putting baby girls like bath stuff in here. These baskets again are from Ikea. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put these or use these for, but thought it would be easier to like put her bath stuff in here since I'm gonna be giving her a bath there so it's like kind of easier to put back and then we have like her shampoos and all that stuff she needs for a bath in here i'm not really going to show you guys that much but it's just like our cleaning stuff and yeah this is nothing to see here then our sino's drawer is literally just random stuff so he has a soap toothbrush and towels in there and then this one is like his tools which i don't know why he left in there this last one has like all his hair stuff and shavers and whatnot yeah that was it for our little bathroom drawer organization nothing too crazy but i know a lot of you guys want to see that and i need to wash my hands because i keep touching my face about to eat lunch I don't know what I'm gonna eat for lunch. I feel like I'm gonna make like a taco salad or something because that honestly sounds so good. I've got my taco salad and then I got Tabasco sauce, you know, for some spice. And then I'm watching Andy Mac on Disney Plus. So, but yeah. What's up, guys? Um, so what time is it? One o'clock, though. So it's one o'clock. I finally got out of bed. Just kidding. But I was working and doing stuff. Here's Kodak. Let's say what's up, bubs. What's up, guys? Anyways. So, Janelle is cooking. Kopiak. Don't mind the chicken. The chicken kind of looks weird in here, but we don't really eat it like that. It's more, she's just boiling it so she can shred it up. That's what we're going to eat today. Janelle is working out. Oh, you can't really see you. Wait. No. Like an hour a day. She's working out, so it'll be easier for her labor. You know, okay, when she comes out, Fat Boy wants to run on the treadmill, but he's still Good, kind of on, shook. He'll put his toy on here and watch it go down. I know he does. I've done it with him before. Okay, Dad. Can I get a butt plug? <laughs> Dad pot season. So it's been about, look, my lipstick is like all out. I'm sorry, but anyways, it's been about like a couple hours now. Me and Orsino just had dinner, but Orsino literally just knocked out because he's in like food coma. But we made our soup, our Kapiak scent soup. I know a lot of you guys wanted me to do like a um, how to cook that and I will soon. I just don't know when yet because it's gonna take a while to do but I just feel weird that like my lipstick is like all out anyways ignore that right now I'm about to do laundry it's 7 o'clock it's 7 13 actually and I need to do about two loads which I can honestly get done in like two and a half hours so I'm gonna do that I am super full I'll show you guys my tummy real quick so when you guys see this video i will be 32 weeks this is how big tummy is right now and just got done eating so it's a little bit bigger than usual but yeah baby girls in here 
She's doing good, good. Getting bigger. And yeah. So, this closet is so messy right now. But this is a load of laundry we have to do. And then I have hubby's over here with his dirty self. I need to do all his colors. Homeboy plays games literally all night. Yeah. This is like his little area. So lucky I let him bring it. Are you about talking shit? Nope. Yep. What was I saying? Oh yeah, so my laundry is my laundry. I can't even speak. But my laundry is almost done and I'm going to get ready to Are go to laundry? bed. Yeah. In a little bit. Oh, right, so, fresh. oh yeah, by the way, Ben. Yeah, what was I say? One of my pink pants stained your underwear. What? One of my pink pants like stained your underwear. Which underwear? It stained a lot of my clothes. What? Yeah. Anyways, um, oh, I, I am too. going to end the vlog right now. Thank you guys so much for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Give this video a thumbs yeah. up. Yeah, I'm gonna give you guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the stay home vlog. It was just like a bunch of cleaning and all that stuff anyways thank you guys again for watching and see you in our next video bye